Somebody just walks up and he's, be like, he's like, maybe he's aggrieved. He's like, man, I'm just too nice. I don't know why I'm too nice. And that's why they keep taking advantage, advantage of me. I'm just too nice and I can't stop being nice. Wow. Somebody's too nice. Do you believe that? Do I believe that? You know, I don't know about you. But let me tell you what I feel. Oh. <laughs> nobody is too nice. And nobody is too bad. I think in every human being, we have both the good and the bad side of us. It has to do with our interaction, with who we are interacting with, and the person's reaction towards us. It brings out whichever side needs to be brought out. So if somebody comes to me and tells me, I'm just too nice, it's either the person doesn't have an introspect, as in the person doesn't know himself, or... Is that person's strategy to penetrate you? So most times when you hear people saying, I'm just too... No, it's either the person is confused about him or herself or it's a strategy. Strategy in the sense... Strategy could mean different things. It could be, I want, to, I want you to, to pity me. <laughs> I want to attract your sympathy. You, you get what I'm saying? So it's still part of the strategy. I want you to see me in certain light. Strategy. I want you to see me in certain ways. So I, for me, I don't believe somebody is just too nice or just too bad. No. Nobody is too bad. Nobody is too nice. We all have it inside of us, the good and the bad. It, it, most times it depends on, when I say somebody is confused, let me also explain that part. It's in the sense that you suppress one part of you. You suppress it and you forget it exists. Only one is existing, which is that one you think it's all you have, which is the good side. But the truth is, if you're too good, you're gullible. If you're too bad, you're also gullible. You just have to balance the two for you to be uptight. I don't know if you understand what I'm saying. Nobody's too, too. So if you suppress, maybe by, you know, most parents, they, 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 they force their, their, their offspring to suppress certain components of them. Like, for instance, they'll be like, man, be nice, be nice to them. No, nah, don't do this, don't do that. Maybe you want to fight for yourself. You want to demand what's yours. Day. My friend, go back, be nice, leave it for him. That kind of it. And as you keep growing, you keep suppressing that. Don't fight for yourself. Don't demand for what's yours. Always be nice. So, in that sense, you become confused of who you are because you're not, you're not expressing yourself to the fullest. I don't know if you understand. You're not expressing yourself to the fullest because one part of you is being suppressed, which is the bad side. Because you know, you know, go expect a person to come now, walk up to you, woes you, maybe in front of your wife, in front of your kids, in front of your parents, even be you alone. And you can just tell the person, God bless you, go, bye-bye. Another person will come, why? No problem. No, now. Your wife's self could tire for you. So most times, everything is in us. It just has to do with our reaction or their reaction brings out whichever one needs to be brought out. So nobody's too nice. Nobody's too bad. I hope we understand that. Thank you. Anyway, this is my own thought. Whatever yours is, put it down at the comment section. It could be making sense. I could learn from yours or you could learn from mine. Thank you guys for watching.